Okay, well. So, there's that. That's a bit upsetting, uh, but it's whatever. I can just compile these two. Anyway, uh, for you non-stream watchers, my internet crashed. Yes. It won't really make much of a difference to you because I'll combine the clips together. But either way, stream crashed. Whatever. All right, that's enough, everyone. They're just amateurs, so try not to bother them too much. Don't you dare call you Narukami oh, an amateur. Bother. We're fine. Right, Senpai? Don't drag me into this. Uh, that, uh, yes, yeah, that's right. Sure. Such a mature response. I like what I'm seeing. Don't touch me, woman. Okay, that's enough. You two gotta know when to put the brakes on these girls. If you don't, you'll never hear the end of it. Oh? Who are these people anyway, Risa Senpai? And there's more coming, right? Like, uh, Yosuke and Chie and Kanji and Kanji and Yukiko and Kanji. I don't think I forget. Oh, oh, Kanji. My bad. I almost forgot about him. I mean, how would that even be possible? Wait, hold on. What did she say? Oh, no. But they are all important to me. They're my friends. More precious to me than anything. Especially Kanji, right? What? For a moment, the four of them are at a loss of words for upon hearing Risa. An odd silence. I don't think what she said was that weird. Oh. Oh. What the? <laughs> What's going on? <laughs> What's going on? Friends, huh? Do you, not, do you guys not have friends? That sounds so nice. Then you guys don't again, have friends? You could say you, Senpai, is special to me. Dang. Ooh, is that so? Ha! <laughs> <laughs> no, no, really. <laughs> You're in trouble. <laughs> I don't understand what the women in the background are saying. Oh, I'm just kind of zoned them out. Well, I guess if anyone can get away with it, it's you, Risei chan that I didn't agree to this. Chan. You're done introducing everyone, right? We need to get started on our lesson. You're right. We ought to get going in that case. When's the game actually gonna start? I just realized that I haven't even been dancing. This has just been dialogue. Stay in your dressing room so I can come get you later. Okay. The oh wow, it's just an okay. Maybe it's odd, but ever since I started coming to talk about productions, I've been seeing a lot of people here to automatically shift gears like this. They're really professionals. I suppose it goes to show that even though these girls are entertainers, through and through. Oh, okay, bye. Oh yes. The TV spot for LMB is gonna start airing. Am I gonna today. dance? You should let everyone know. It'll be broadcast. Nice. I don't. Thanks I want to no play the game. This is just dialogue. If I wanted dialogue, I would have gone out and bought a PC and bought Persona 4 on Steam. I shouldn't really do that. And though I said is the last to leave, and we're stuck. Just back us three in the studio. The suddenly quiet aftermath. That's a lumber. Lumbers. Oh, that's what we filmed the other day. Yes. Could that have not been like a it's mini really game for me to play? Here. Is it finally hitting you? That's right. All our smiling faces will be on TVs all across Japan. I'm not smiling. There's no backing out of this now, okay, Nato-kun? Come now. You needn't say it like that. I just want to play a game. I'll about the ad later. Let's get practicing. I'm Email. I'm sure they'll be watching even if we don't tell them about it. <laughs> so, well, are you point, suggesting we don't tell them? I doubt they'd ever are you suggesting we miss like out this. on an opportunity to talk to Kanji? She's a point. I think all of our faces are the friends of Edomar. I can't help but smile. The Love Me Bond Festival TV commercial introduces all the participants to the event, so we're all participating in that film too. We're going to appear on TV, and this time it won't be some bizarre program that only comes at midnight. That does feel a little embarrassing, but it'll certainly be an exciting experience. Not to mention, my friends are, are even more attentive to this kind of thing than I am. They probably already invited each other over and over, each other over, and are watch it, waiting for the commercial broadcast. The funny metal image. Oh, uh, the funny men metal metal you Narukami. <laughs> the funny mental image brings a smile to my face. I'm gonna start trying to imitate Johnny Young, Bosch. So Love fun. meets Bonds Festival. Oh. Let passionate songs and dance echo across the world. First kind. In addition to this all-star cast, there will be special guests. Like Bonds. Come on, yes. yes. No, I don't care about her. Get her off the screen. Group, Konami, no. I don't care. Where's Kanji? Come join us. We'll form a passionate bond with you all. I want to form a bond with Kanji so when I buy Persona 4. Kanji! Yes! Kanji! I don't look at I like this game. That night, Risa Inato and I were still spending our time at the dance studio at Takara Production Studios. Ooh. 
more poppin' tunes, unless this is the same tune and it's just playing again. Power up production, listen to me. One, two, three, four, two, two, oh. three, four. That's not how that goes. That's not how that, that's not how you count. That's like if I were to go A, B, C, D, B, B, C, D. That's not how that works. Hey guys, let's stop for a bit. Yes. I don't need to hear Risei's dumb counting methods. Now, where is Kanji? That's not Kanji. <sighs> This is, this is intense. I didn't envision it to be this tough. It's all worked out in my head, but well, as a kanji a main in Blaze Blue Cross Tag Battle, uh, I demand necessary. to see him. But once you have that, all you need to do is show how you feel by moving with the music. The animation is awesome. It's like, now I haven't played Persona 4. Uh, again, I have never played the game, so I don't know what the animation is like compared to the actual game. Uh, but from what I've seen, it's definitely a better adaptation than what the Persona 5 animation did for, you know, Persona 5. Uh, it did it, to my knowledge, it didn't really cut down a lot compared to what Persona 5 did because uh, Inaba is a really small town, so you can't really make what's small and, like, much smaller if it already fits into something. What's the point in making it smaller if it fits just fine? So I think the Persona 4 anime at least does that right. It just... I want to play the game. <laughs> Is that how it works? It's exactly how it works. You, senpai, what do you think about when you dance? Now, when I dance, I don't think. But just for now, I'm going to say... I don't think of anything, really. <laughs> See, he gets He's it. He's having fun. He gets That's it. That's how it should be. Dancing isn't just about moving Me, to the he, rhythm. Me, you know, we're the same people at the end of the day. It's expressing yourself and your feelings to the people watching you. Yeah. If you're trying to get across the message that this is fun, then us dancers need to be having more fun than anyone. Yeah. Expressing one's We're feelings, dancing. huh? That makes a kind of sense. Oh, I could just. Oh my God! <laughs> I held it down for like two seconds. Who's calling me? <gasps> Yosuke. It's Yosuke. I need to step out for. Wait, a what's going? What happened before? Uh, can we please uh, take a short break. Uh, we say it's still raring to go, but it's clear now to the legs are shaky. As I'm decided on how I can help with the situation. Okay, Yosuke. Okay, then we'll start right after you come back. Oh, I'm saved. You're welcome, Nato. Well, you better thank Yosuke, not me. Yosuke? Give the phone to Kanji? <laughs> Takara Production Hallway. Is this like a point and click adventure game? Hello? Yosuke? Yo, partner. Are you okay to talk right now? Hell yeah. yeah. It's fine. Good. Awesome. At the sound of the familiar voice on the line, I can't help but smile in relief. My partner, Inidaba, keeps talking to me in his useless, careless, uh, carefree tone. Dude, we saw the commercial! We all gathered around the TV at Juness when it was on. You guys got called weird names. And seeing that stuff got us all pumped up. Yeah. Are we all celebrities now? Maybe I should start working on my autograph. I don't know. That'd be a good idea. Oh, okay. Anyway, we're heading over there tomorrow. We leave first thing in the morning, so I'm sure we'll get there before noon. <laughs> Just wait until you see where all our training is got. I'm waiting to see Kanji! I look forward to it. Even at our first practice, Yosuke surprised us with his naturally deft moves. The videos that Risa's been recording only prove that he's been getting better and better. It's been a while since then, so I'm sure he'll show us a dance as amazing as he says. Lost in thought, I pick up on what sounds like argument on the other side of the call. It's already starting. I can easily picture what's happening on their end, and I end up smi smiling despite myself. Dude! Teddy! Hold your horses! You'll get your turn! So, hey! Oh my god, Teddy just killed Yosuke. Hello, is this Sensei? I'm doing very well. What about Yosuke? Oh yeah? I'm glad to hear that. Didn't even question what happened to Yosuke, you. Teddy is a resident of the TV world that we met through cases we solved. Still, he's an important friend as the rest of us. Right now, he lives at Yosuke's. Normally, he wears his trademark bear fur in the local kids' show and at the local kids. And the local kids know him as the mascot of the department of the department store Juness. I can word. However, judging by his tone of voice, he must be taking his inner form as a young man right now. Sounds like he grabbed Yosuke's cell away, though. He might end up regretting it. I bet it must be lonely without me there. It's Don't very lonely without that. Kanji, though. I'll get him on the phone. The tomorrow to get married to you, Sensei. Huh? That should be interesting. Excuse me? Nana-chan and Pops are coming too, of course. Nanako? Let's see, what other news is there? Okay. Huh? Did Yosuke just get ki Yosuke come back from revenge and kill Teddy? Yeah. Damn it, Teddy! I was still talking to him. Yeah, so, Yosuke's Yosuke, revenge. Violence is 
Didn't you just like body slam him to get the phone? Sounds like you two are still getting along. You two live in the same home. What gave you that idea? Because you guys are arguing. Anyway, that's the gist of it. We're coming tomorrow. Tell Risa and Naoto we said hi. See ya. Can I talk to Kaji, please? Okay. Oh, okay. I've tried to tell them. I don't really care about this part. No, not yet. I was just taking a call. Yeah. Oh, I see. Uh, by the way, I'm sorry about the commotion this afternoon. Is Risei Chan still with you? Well, no, she's actually with Naoto, yes, but. She's helping us right No, she's with Naoto, you. I think I've you yet. I'm still surprised that you agreed to perform. Hey. Would you like some coffee? You, you, Yosuke, Kanji, and Teddy all pretended to be females for a contest. I think he can do just about anything. I graciously accept the coffee and answer it. In no, in, in no way, San smile with one of my own. Agreed to perform. In no way, San most likely referring to the backup dancing at L &D. Thank you. We were surprised too. I never thought we'd be asked to perform with Risei in her comeback show. Is this what's? Is this how the game's gonna turn into like? Uh oh, the world's gonna John end. insisted on it as soon as her spot at the festival was. I decided. feel like In no way is gonna be like a bad guy somehow. As close as you all are to her, you're still just ordinary folks. To be honest, I was against it at first. How could you? You should. Rehearse convinced me. I knew then this would be a great show. Are you like a bad guy? Is that so? <laughs> I've been working in this industry for quite a while now, you know. You don't look I like it. A sixth sense as a manager. You don't really look that old. There's no question that Risei John changed after getting to know you all. Is that a bad thing? She always had something special that shined from within. But I feel like that's been polished to an even brighter gleam. Awesome. When Risei with you, she right? seems to glow even more than usual. Yeah, she has a weird infatuation for you. That's why I decided to place my bets on all of you. Give you a place on the reborn Risei Kujikawa's big debut. Awesome. Are we for contract? I don't know what that means, so we're going to go with it. Are we there to make Risei look good in comparison? Oh, okay, that's what he meant. <laughs> oh, ouch. I can't think of anything to say to that. I'm serious though. There's no need to worry. We're cool. professionals. If you and your friends give a hundred percent, I'll give a hundred and one percent. We'll amplify that energy and put on a hell of a show for the audience. Oh, the first swear. As your friend's manager, I'll give you all the support I can as well. Awesome. Thank you. I keep saying awesome. In no way, son, he usually seems like a fairly stoic person, but when he talks about Risa, his face really lights up. I guess even as a, comp a competitive show-based person, a professional. Risei has that much charm. I'm filled with sudden pride and relief from both his praise of Risei and his confidence in us. I can only reply with a grateful nod. Thank you. Oh, I forgot I was in a hurry. I'll talk to the management, so go ahead and keep using the studio. Make you got sure it. you're not up too late, though. Can't promise anything. I understand. By the way, what's your hurry? Oh, it's probably nothing. You haven't seen the Kanamine Kitchen Girls, have you? Nope. Or someone that looked like them, maybe? What? No, I haven't seen them. The only time I did was when you were introducing us. Are they copycats? That's all right then. I'm sorry if I said anything to worry you. Well, I should head to a meeting now, so I'll see you later. Weird. Okay. That's a little mm -hmm. unnatural. I recall the four hour limit this afternoon as I considered the situation. It might not be Risei's level, but they're big names for Takura Productions. It seems like it seems odd that Inoue sent a manager would ask me for the whereabouts. He looked somewhat flustered as well. Did something has happened? And I, as I puzzle over it, someone bolts in front of me and I tr and trips, failing, flailing wildly. Who fell? Oh, wait, oh. She worked Crocs? She's, who are you? You look like... Not Risa. Seeing her skid across the lax floor of the hallway like a baseball player sliding home catches me a bit by surprise. Who are you? Not Risa, who wears Crocs. Your name is Risa with Crocs now, until I actually know your name. After an extreme fall like that, she might not be up for talking. I'm gonna ask her anyway. Are you alright? She's probably gonna tell me no. Uh, face first. Uh, that really hurt. Hi, Risa oh, Crocs. Someone saw me. Hi. I'm sorry. I'm really sorry. Uh, it's there's... nothing. I'm fine. I'll leave. Quietly, calmly, and right away. Okay. And I'm gone. Wait, no, hold on. I gotta know your name. I can't, I can't keep calling you Risei with Crocs. Come back. The girl babbles on and on before she zooms off at full speed like a clumsy tornado. What was that all about? She took quite the fall. Did she hurt herself? 
Actually, I guess it could have been off the phone with Yosuke for quite a while now. If I make the others wait any longer, we say we'll probably get impatient and get Naoto up and start practicing again. And if that happened, Naoto would definitely hold a grudge against me. It'd probably be best for... Naoto's not going to hold a grudge against you for probably being on the phone. Having reached a conclusion, I quickly head back into the... with coffee. Go Pepe. Save... Oh, uh, new chapter, maybe? Oh, no, just transitioning to a new scene. Lessons hey, for you. Hey, there you are, senpai. Hello. And welcome back. Hi. Here it is. The pre-LMB report. Wow, lettuce, somebody's already uploaded the Lettuce, list. mayonnaise, bacon. Ew, that sounds, actually, that sounds gross. Lettuce, mayonnaise, bacon. That sounds gross. When I get back, I find Risei and Nato in conversation while looking at their phones. Risei beckons me over, and I sidle over them. Or sidle behind them. It looks like they were watching a website affiliated with the LMB Fest. I look at the phone screen as well and see a reporter with four members of the Kahneman Kitchen we met this afternoon. Sure enough, it's the girls we met earlier. Oh, no. Is this where the spooky video plays? Oh, hi. We're live with the members Wait, of Wait, you look like Rise with Crocs. Yes. Well then, I'm Tomoe Sayama, your soft lamb. I may be a bit gamey, but one bite and you'll be hooked. I love gaming. Come to Love Meets Bonds, and I'll see to it you have the time of your life. Can you see to it that I'm gaming? Have, I'm Tamami Uesugi, your fluffy hen and delicious to the bone. I'm always number one. So is my suit stock. I hate to brag to you, but I don't like suits. I'm in this thing, so you better come see me. If you don't, I'll never speak to you again. Okay. I'm Samomo Ujima, everyone's picklet. I'm a pudgy ball of fun who rolls around all day, every day. <laughs> Yay! Why are these guys all being animals? We've got the hen, uh, the lamb, and now the, now the pig. Come you don't spend time with me, I'm gonna cry. Pigs don't do that. I am Nakahara, your noble it's, it's, stag. As like a, a as horse? I am beautiful, I look forward to an amazing night spent together. I don't, I don't know what a stag is, but I'm assuming it's an animal. I see, it's the interview members with the Ketamine Kitchen since they're performing at LMB. In any case, I had quite the impact. I think we should, should we think of a greeting like this? My gaze switches off when I'm over a thought. And Napa mutters, sounding a bit overwhelmed. Well, those are some unusual taglines. A lamb, hen, yeah. piglet, and stag? That's what I said. I suppose it's unique, but... It's a little well, off. Well, whole shtick as an idol group is that they're all edible meats. Oh. Edible meats? The, they're up for consumption? That's a weird shtick. <laughs> yeah. There's so many idols nowadays, you won't survive if you don't stand out from the crowd. I'm not a huge fan of the shtick. So that's not the only thing they have going for them. The battle between the corrupt, impossibly demanding producer and the poor, hard-working idols. That's what? another angle they're taking that's got them a lot of their current popularity. Being against the norm? Uh, producer? Is that a common problem in the world of showbiz? I wouldn't doubt it. Oh no, it's not actually like that. That's just another strategy to get them over with the public. Risei, didn't you quit showbiz because of corrupt uh, managers or whatever? Yeah, correct, producers. D isn't that why you left showbiz? I can't and remember. Again, knowing her, I have to wonder if there isn't some truth to it. it is that so? Yeah, it's probably. The same one who's the overall producer of LMB. It just goes to show that it takes all kinds in this business. Cool. From Risa's description, it sounds like there are a lot of strategies. Like that's what she just said. The reporter on the screen moves behind an, an even more flamboyant girl. I don't really care what the last bit said. What animal are you? Then, let's finish up with a word to the fans from Konami-san. Konami. Oh, of course. Um, is around here okay? I've seen her on TV before. That's Konami Mashita. She's the lead member of Konami Kitchen. While I was on break, they started calling her the next Rosette. It's frustrating, but she's definitely hot I used, right now. I thought it was Even pronounced Reset, like not Rosette. I come out on but, top anymore. oh well. Wait a sec. Okay, she's definitely had a boob job. Okay, we don't need that. I'm Konami Mashta, your prize cow. My meat okay, is you're a cow. My movement is slow, and I sleep off every meal. That's... Everyone, join me in wishing that the weather will be bright and sunny on the day of the festival. This game's a little it's different than I expected. It's lately, and we all get sweaty in the sun, so make sure you bathe and brush your teeth while you're at it. I feel like she's going off script. Thank mean and I take it you all have some closing remarks of course well then everyone on the day of that okay me will be extra enjoy oh. every last bite okay that's a 
call for our pre love meets bonds festival. Love report. meat? Love meat. Like meat. The food. It makes sense. Nami san wasn't with the group when we saw them this afternoon. Was she resaving Crux? Nami san mentioned she was doing PR for her solo photo book. To be honest, Konami sells much more than the other four. I mean, the group's named after her. Yeah. I've been feeling this way since filming the TV commercial, but... I'm about to... I just unleashed a sneeze into my mouth. All those appearing on stage whatever. for this know, event will be industry professionals, no? Probably, well, I don't amateurs know. Amateurs like us shouldn't participate in this after all. Now, Toe, stop doubting yourself. Okay, there are so many reasons why we should be participating. One, I get to play a video game. Two, this actually sounds kind of fun. And three, kanji. There you go with that again. Don't worry about it. When it comes to outsized personalities, we're a match for Konami's group. I'm not so sure that's something to be proud of. You know, something that is something to be proud Me of? Me neither. Dancing. I, I said you'll be fine. Anyway, it's getting late. Why don't we get in one last... It's that late already? Yosuke-senpai and the others will be here tomorrow. Well, that being said, I'm a... What? Seriously? You've still got some juice left, though, right, you senpai <laughs> Ask nicely. Oh, I'm on my limit. I'm running pretty ragged too. That's amazing, senpai. As ragged as you're feeling, you're still gonna keep at it. You're not listening to me. You'll give this last one everything you got, right? Is this the game moment where I can play the game? Risa seems cheerful enough. Gaze locked on me, but her smile doesn't quite reach her eyes. Looks like I'd better go along and practice at least one more time. I give a small nod and roll my shoulder and stretch my tired muscles. Looks like I can keep going a little longer. All right, you senpai. Let me know when you're ready to start. Is this a gameplay? Can I play? <gasps> I can. It's a tutorial, but I can play the game. Let's Midnight stage. I can play the game. Hello, everyone. Professor Teddy here. Hi. While Sensei and the others are learning their steps, we ought to try some dancing too. Okay. Let's start with the basics. Press the buttons to match your timing with the flying notes. Okay. Isn't this a uh, specialist? The one meme song. You get the idea? All right, your turn now. Feel the rhythm and oh, press wait. those buttons. I w was I not pressing them right? I wasn't pressing them. It was the game. I thought yeah, I was Yeah, that's how you do it. Okay, time for lesson two. Okay. Sometimes you'll see rings that look like this. Those they are scratches. Totally different. For these, you just flick the left or right analog stick. They're different. Even if you mess three, these five. ones up, it doesn't count as a mistake. So don't stress out over them. Yeah, but you need When the ring combo. overlaps with the outer circle, just move the stick in any direction. Fever. Wait oh. a sec. That last one looked kind of funky, right? It looked this is called a fever amazing. ring. They're pretty much like scratches. But okay, if you okay. get enough of them right, your dance is going to go into fever time. Awesome. All kinds of good stuff happens in fever time, so get it whenever you can. Okay. Now, last up is how to clear the stage and win. Okay. This hype gauge here tells you how much the audience I... is enjoying the show. Depending on how good your dancing is, it'll change like this. If the audience's okay. excitement gets too low, then that's it. Show's over. And even Dang, if you rough. dance to the end, you'll only win if the audience had a good time. Psst. One more thing. If you get fever time when the audience is hyped up, something very good might happen. Okay. Alrighty, now let's bring it home. Bust a move. Time to bust a move. Bam. 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 Stretch. Bam. Right. Up. Stretch. Yeah, you got the hang of it. And that's it for tonight's lesson. Neat. Till next time, everybody. Bye, Teddy. Man, I pressed like uh, 15 buttons and half of those weren't even my own inputs. I don't want to sound pretentious or anything, but I think I've been moving a lot smoother lately. In the beginning, all I could hope for was just getting through the steps kind of strange so that I'm getting used to this whenever I used to be such an ordeal. Good job. Or whenever it like, used to be such an ordeal. And you've improved so much already. Oh, that Bye. was amazing to watch, Senpai. I must improve my own performance to match. Good. I don't know what these character models look like yet. I've seen nothing about this game other than, like, a brief glimpse of the Adachi song. That's it. Who's clapping? Huh? 
Miss Ochimizu? Who's that? As Re at Risei's words, my attention goes to the woman leisurely striding towards us. From her elegant, formal appearance, I get a sense of pride, dignity, and unmistakable authority. That demeanor, could she be the overall producer of the LMB fest that Risei mentioned? Is this where we find out who Risei Indeed. would cross it? Nope. It was most impressive. Thank I you. even left my meeting early to see for myself how things were going. Did you like it? Do you need something? We're in the middle of rehearsal. I wouldn't have come if I had no business here. Did we do something wrong? How low Takura Productions has fallen. I only permitted this farce because Inoue begged me. What the hell? Rise Kujikawa. Don't tell me that you intend to put these children on the stage. They're barely at the level of a school performance. What the hell? I just pressed 15 buttons and half of them were a bot. I explained before, but we have the organizer's approval for my friends to come on stage with me. My fans are cheering for us, and my agency made the call that this will be a good way to push my name. It sure is. Yes, I'm sure your fans would say that. Yeah, but what, 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 isn't that what we want? Though I'm curious to know what the fans of the other idols, who have no interest in Risei Kuchikawa, would think of it. Who cares? That's... My apologies. I retract the question. No, 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 we're not done here. It's useless asking you anyway, as you're nothing but a pretty face. That's so mean. Nothing but... That's just rude! That's what I said. What good can come of complaining to a plastic dress-up doll? That's... You're stupid! You look Your dumb! Your masters are the ones who should know their place. That would be Inoue. Or, in fact, Takura Productions as a whole. Now you shut up! I'm having fun! Outrage flashes across Risei's face. Uh, outrage is flashing across my face! And the room suddenly gets tense as it gets ugly. I want in on this! This producer... Oh, ch I'm gonna call you stupid. This producer is stupid. Some of what she's saying is correct, but it isn't something we'll take lying down. It's not just Risei, even though we can keep a better handle of our emotions, Nata and I are feeling that same anger. Before Risei has a chance for an outburst, I step forward and make call eye contact with Miss Stupid. Hey, Miss Stupid! Senpai. You take that back! Please take that back. Risei is doing the best she can. You gotta be firm about it, you. Ah, quite the loyal friend you have. That's right! For all the good that does you, real life isn't that easy. Shove it! No event that I produce will feature any perfunctory performances. You're a perfunct, whatever that means. Practice until you drop. You're free to make a fool of yourself in here, but no mistakes will be tolerated on stage. Fine then, I'll full combo every single song in this damn game if it makes you feel better, Miss Stupid. Miss Stupid makes a brief speech in the small curt tone, in the same curt tone, unfazed by my gaze, and then turns on her heel, heading for the door. No wonder she's risen so high in the world of show business. Though part of me is impressed, I squash that feeling and continue staring at her as she walks away. Then again, it could be that your moment in the spotlight will be removed entirely. Pardon? Risei Kujikawa, depending on what happens, I may have you pair up with Konami at LMB. The new set list will be released tomorrow. Once it's settled which way we'll go, I'll contact Inoue about our decision. You're dumb. Huh? Wait, what? I don't understand what you're talking about! I don't either, and I'm a little mad about you it. You don't need to understand. Just do what you're told. I've already discussed this with Takara Productions. I don't care! Take direction, it back! Then your friend's presence won't be required. No, no, my friend, my, my presence and my friend, especially Kanji's, will be required. Excuse me, but our friends will be here tomorrow. And they're traveling quite a distance just to perform at this festival. Yeah, Miss Stupid. My sincerest apologies for that. We'll have seats reserved so that they may enjoy the concert. No, I'm just what just happened. We won't be performing? Nata must be thinking the same thing. When I meet her eyes, she looks as bewildered as I am. What was that about? I'm gonna go have a talk with the san about this. You do that. I'm gonna sit here and complain to Nato about it. Nato, I'm Isan. mad. She's gone. What's going on here? Is it involving that midnight thing? Let's go after Should her. we go after her? I'm not so sure. Even if we do, I doubt we'll learn much. I'll yell. I'll yell. Okay, angry. Reset on. Reset. Ding dong. Doorbell. <gasps> reset with Crocs. It is a reset, but a strangely familiar girl. Where have I seen her before? Right, she's the girl I saw earlier in the hallway. The one who had quite the nasty uh, faceplant. Uh, excuse me. Is Miss Chimizu? Um. Her name is Miss Stupid, and you will call Chimizu. her by name. Oh, you mean the producer? She left a moment ago. 
Who are you, Reese with Crocs? Seeing Nato look for look at me look to me for confirmation, I nod to the girl. More importantly, I had forgotten to ask earlier, but I hope she didn't hurt herself too badly when she tripped. Oh, okay. <laughs> oh man, what am I gonna do? Unfog your glasses and tell Excuse me your real me, name. You are? Reese with Crocs. And she's gone, right? Senpai, you're not gonna Huh? Konami? What are you doing here? That's Konami? Oh, or Konami? It's Rise Senpai. Way too long time no see. You're Rise with Crocs? After Rise bursts through the door, the girls greet each other as if they know each other. The place is a showbiz office, so it's only natural that Rise's acquaintances would be here, but however, we're caught a bit off guard. I think Rise called this girl Konami just a moment ago. Sorry, Rise, but can you explain to us what's going on here? Like why Rise with Crocs knows you? Wait. Okay, that oh, makes sense. Right. Let me introduce you guys. This Konami. is Konami Mashta, lead Ka member of Konami Ka Kitchen. Ka Konami? This is Konami Mashta. Konami. Konami-san? Wait, the same one who was in that video? <laughs> the one who tripped and fell on her face Konami's and like wears Crocs in the camera. middle of the she's studio? She's and boring looking. It's a lot different than her image when she's on the job. Weren't you reserved and boring looking whenever you quit and being an idol? And that's how it works? But she seems like a completely different person. Wasn't her hair dyed? <laughs> I get that a lot. You look like Rise. She really does completely different. It's hard to believe that this is economy son is the same economy son in that video. Still, now's not the time for what. I I'm just gonna skip a little past this, just a little bit. Disappear. Wait, disappear? Economy and kitchen girls? Yeah. Looks like they can't get a hold of them at all, <gasps> and everyone's running around looking for them. I Midnight. Think that's why Miss Ochimizu said those things earlier. Rise's revelation is enough to shock us all in a brief silence that I can't get in contact with the members of Konami and Kitchen? I see. That must have been the reason I know I said to ask why I've seen them. That must mean why there's Miss Stupid. And then there's Miss Stupid. This would explain why she suddenly ordered Rise to pair with Konami-san, which is why she told us to might be performing. At that moment, everything connects. Next to Minato rests her hands and head against her chin thoroughly as to make productions. I see. If they remain missing until the day of the festival, there'll be an opening in the lineup. Miss Ochimizu worried about this possibility. But we just saw those girls this afternoon. Would the producer go to those links just because she lost contact with the group for a few hours? Probably. This is Miss Ochimizu we're talking about. Her name is Miss Stupid. I know about that discussion already. Miss Ochimizu told me it'll work out as long as you're around. Okay. Still, I can't help but worry about them. That's why I was looking for Miss Ochimizu. It'll work out. But they're the rest of your own group. And not only that, they're food. They're well known celebrities. What if they've gotten swept up in something serious? Yeah, like the midnight thingy that I saw at I the beginning know. of the game. But she said she'll keep a lid on this until the festival's over. What? Is that what she thinks of us? Idols aren't toys that can be replaced. Hmm. If this truly is a case of them going missing, there are a number of measures we can take. Like relaunching the investigation team. First. Let's speak with the event organizers and ha hold on a moment. Look at me, surprise. Please don't give me that look. Rise, anger, and Nato's precautions are both justified. I've learned over these past months that the showbiz could be pretty cool, but this is something totally different. As far as I can tell, four girls have gone missing. This sounds like a case. However, we need more information. I looked at Konami, Konami stand and asked the questions on my mind. Konami san, when did they lose contact with the rest of the group? Was it, didn't he say like just a few hours ago? Not too long ago, I think. I only heard about it from Miz Ochimizu a moment ago. Awesome. Like I said, we met them just this afternoon. Even if we went to the police with this, I doubt they'd pay us any mind. Plus, if this doesn't turn out to be anything serious, wouldn't it put the girls in a bad position? Oh, yeah, that's true. You're right. We should take it into our own hands. I gave Inoue-san a real scare a while back myself, but even then, he waited quite a while before going to the police. If he had reported me missing at the time, it could have snowballed into a much bigger problem. Like having to be in jail. Oh, uh, same here. One time I slept through a day off I finally got, and even through the day after that. Dang. My agency apologized to our partners and said I'd been laid up with a cold. All that oversleeping gave me such a headache. That's not as serious as the situation here. But you, Senpai, may have a point. Well then, why don't we do this? If no one has heard from the rest of the group by tomorrow, and if they refuse to make a move, then we'll take things into our own hands and notify the police directly. Are you a detective? That sounds reasonable. Yosuke and the others will be here tomorrow too, along with Dojima-san. And Nanako, right? That's who Nana-chan is? That's 
Yeah, there's Nanachan, because Nanachan is what Teddy calls Nanako, so yeah. Ryotaro Tojima, my uncle from Inaba, will be coming here along with his daughter Nanako. Yeah, Nanako. He will be on vacation, but my uncle is a working police detective. For a case like this, I'm sure he'd be the best person to ask for advice. So, even if the police are out of the question, Dojima-san might hear us out? Yeah. Good call, senpai. You're so smart. I just took the things I have at the current moment. So if I'll be smart. Basically, clasps her hands in front of her chest, a bit of melodrama melodramatically, while Nato nods and to hide her satisfied smile. With a nostalgic feeling, I can easily tell what they're feeling by their reactions. That's when I noticed in the corner of my eye, Konami Sam is staring, dumbfounded, unable to join in on the conversation. Oh, you all get along so well. That's so neat. You wanna be our friend? We've been through a lot together, that's all. Like we all became close friends before we knew it. Now, you can't become Kanji level of friend, but you could surely become something like uh, Teddy levels of friend. Close friends. I could be your friend. Konami, no spacing out now. You're helping out too, okay? Yeah, we say with Crocs. Huh? Wait. Really? You'll let me join you? Uh. Then why wouldn't we? You came looking for Miss Ochimizu because you were worried about the others, no? Wouldn't that make your goal the same as ours? We won't force you, though. You decide what's best for you, Konami-san. What's best for me? You look totally different. I feel the same as you guys. I'm worried about them. Cool. And you're already one of us. You're part of our circle. Oh, hooray! I made some friends! Let's sure meet did. up again once the others get here tomorrow. Oh, but you have work, right, Konami? Well, if anything comes up, I'll make sure to email you. Oh, email. Uh, you know, Konami, you need to stop waiting for other people to speak first. You're an idol. Assert yourself more. People only think shyness is cute for so long. Yes. I'm sorry. Sorry? Such a harsh world they live in. What's sorry? Oh, it's pretty late, so let's call it a night. I'm sure Nato kun wants to freshen up too, so. Senpai, we're gonna ask you to stay in the room next door for a little while. Let's meet back here in a bit. I I have an early morning tomorrow, so I'll be excusing myself. I just have to sleep in the nap room. Gotcha. Let's get to it, everyone. Okay. We nod at Risei's words and each go our separate ways. We need to freshen up and wait for Yusuke. Yusuke? <laughs> I mean, Risei and Naoto to finish changing, so I take my thing and head to the room next door. Still, I'm wearing the kind of kitchen members' whereabouts are unknown. What could have happened to them? They probably got taken to the end Midnight Man thing, you know, that they talked about at the beginning of the game. Is this just a conversation between Nata No. After getting ready to leave and killing enough time for Risa and Nata to change, I return to the studio and find the door ajar. I guess they're finished and ready to go. I take a quick side glance just to be safe and see them standing around their belongings lost in conversation. Looks like I may have made them wait instead. But much as I hate to admit it, once she became the producer, Konami immediately started taking off. Sorry for the wait. Are you both done? Oh. Were you talking about Miss Ochimisu? Miss Stupid. Oh, Senpai, are you ready to go? But she's always like that. So even though she's legit, everyone calls her corrupt. They say she's the worst producer ever. She overworks her idols and makes shameless cash grabs from the fans. Dang. Some go so far as to call her a demon or a money grubber, including fans of the idols she's produced. When she started with Konami and Kitchen, she had footage shown on TV of her forcing impossible demands on those girls. That's rough. Let's see. So by showing images of them being abused as they earnestly pursued their dreams, it would only encourage the audience to cheer them on out of sympathy. Exactly! That's the kind of thing she's good at! But doesn't it seem like cheating? Plus, if it really was all an act, I might respect it. Really? But she's exactly the same when the cameras aren't rolling, so sometimes I seriously wonder if she's not faking it. Hmm. Having been on the receiving end, I can see why you'd think so. Right? She always makes us do insane things without running them by us. Dang, that's I rough. I wish she'd think about the people who actually have to do that stuff. Like, uh, what's what she up to? What about L and B? Do you think Miss Ochimisu is scheming something with that? Hmm, I don't know. What if Konami and Kitchen going missing is another one of Miss Ochimisu's promotional tactics? What? I hadn't considered that possibility. Wait, scratch that idea. Even Miss Ochimizu wouldn't go that far. Uh, I think. I see. By the by, there's something I'd like to mention which may have no bearing on this case. 
heard an odd rumor regarding the festival. You did? An odd rumor? Yes. If you go to the festival website at midnight, it plays an unusual video. Oh, uh, yep. Uh, explanations I've already seen. Now, Tokun, you're scared, huh? Yes. But that isn't important. Dang, I didn't that's bring rough. this up to talk about that. Risa and I can't help but exchange looks at Nato's inability to hide her anxiety. Still, she's right. Now's not the time to be worrying about something Go like on, that. Go on, Yes. Anyway, there's something that disturbs me about this rumor. What's hmm? that? Well, doesn't it seem a bit similar to our prior experiences? When you look at a switched-off TV at midnight on a rainy day, you'll see your soulmate. You're talking about the Midnight Channel. Yeah. The Midnight Channel, the cause behind the mystery we faced when we were high schools. High school. I don't know. A world within TVs, the monsters called Shadows lurking there with an enigmatic serial murderer case centered in the town of Inaba. All the memories of last year flashed through my mind in an instant, a sudden chill running down my spine. We wait now till his next words are growing on ease, justified once more. Of course, it's hard to say how much we can trust these sorts of rumors. On the other hand, this particular rumor has some troubling aspects to it. S such as? There have been genuine victims, and their numbers have been rapidly increasing. Uh oh. Though naturally, there's no proven correlation between the victims and the rumor. It's quite possible that the rumor sprung up in reaction to the victims. But it's a fact that a good handful of people are in a comatose state right now. A coma? Seriously? Is this another case with another world? That's probably what Risa was going to ask. I was wondering the same thing myself, but Nato shakes her head in response to Risa's There's question. There's no knowing whether this is a case yet or not. I only briefly heard about it the other day during work. I was going to look into it. And if it did turn out to be connected to that case... I thought it might be necessary for me to consult everyone about it. The LMB website at midnight, huh? Offhand, I glanced towards the clock high on the studio wall, 11.58 p.m., almost midnight. If I pointed it out, at the very least, the three of us would check for the truth behind the rumor. It's almost midnight. Why don't we check it out for ourselves? I knew you'd say that. Are you In scared? Honesty, I doubt that this rumor has anything to do with the disappearances, but all the same... It may be faster to get to the bottom of this rumor ourselves. Yeah. Wait, you want us to look at it right here, right now? Yeah. Jeez, fine. But we're all gonna look at it together. How bad can it be? Senpai, you come over here. Now, Tokun, you're over there. And whatever happens, no running away, okay? Let's see. Yeah, I got Love it. Love meets bonds. Oh, here it is, the official LMB site. Okay, let's do it. We say touch our cell phones, touch screen, and the LMB Fest website comes up. Sell it, set lists, uh, ticket details, participating artists, several topics and details have been added, but the website seems mostly unchanged from the other times we've checked it. The site appears to be operating normally. See? Nothing's coming up. That rumor has to be fake. I check the clock on the wall again and see how it's a minute before midnight. I just hope nothing unusual Wait, happens. What is this? Uh oh. Risei's voice pulls me back to the phone screen and I see something completely new being displayed. Crackling static fills the screen and then eerie light flickers, countless shadows sway and the, and the visual noise just barely visible. What's happening? Uh oh. Hi. They do look like human silhouettes. They we... seem to be dancing, don't they? Isn't that the point? Uh oh. What just happened? Do we get sucked into the death? Where am I? Where's you? That's all of it. You? This has to be just a prank. I'm gonna check with the admins about this. Oh, <laughs> or it's part of Miss Ochimizu's PR. I bet she spread that weird rumor to get Konami's group to sell more. What's that sound? What's going on? That's when I noticed it, just on the edge of hearing. What was that? I concentrate trying to focus on what that sound was. If it's just here, I can't have heard something unusual, What's right? What's the matter, Senpai? I heard something scary. I'm Did hearing you something hear scary. Something just now? I'm hearing something right now. 
I, I heard it. Yeah, I heard it too. I'm scared. No way. So it wasn't just me? You heard it too? <laughs> uh oh. Voice? <gasps> portal. What is that? It's a portal to the other world of awesome. I follow Nato's gaze and notice an eerie light swaying near the studio ceiling. Like a fog machine or a stage pyrotechnic effect. It lights up a strange light. It's as if it's looking down upon us. Come and say Kuji Kawa. I prepared a place just for you. Ignore it. Who are you? How do you know my What the Uh oh. Hands. Ah! Or rappers, streamers? Ah! Uh, no, my friends. Shit, me <laughs> Oh no, what's going on? I'm actually concerned. What's happening? We're dying! No! Where are we? Kujikara Rise. Senpai! You, Senpai! Yeah, I'm awake. Hello? Oh, you're up. Thank goodness. I didn't feel like it. I stare at the sound of Rise calling my name. Where am I? The last thing I remember was that weird light in the Koa production studio, and then... Where are Sorry we? Sorry about that. Where are we? Where's Nato? Most likely the oh, other <laughs> video are taken to. Wherever that may be, it I'm seems scared. the rumor was true. What's happening? Wherever it is, it's too dark to see anything. What should we do, Senpai? Scream like a child. I'm scared. Shadow thing. Voice. Welcome, Rise Kujikawa, to our midnight stage. I sent my name. Midnight stage. That's right. An ideal world where no one hurts or gets hurt. But my name's not Rise. Rise. Yeah. What am I doing here? A stage for you all. Here. Take a look. Is it the thing that says Kujikawa Rise behind us? It is. I'm scared. Suddenly a dim light turns out and we realize where we are. Well, perhaps it's not exactly where we are, but what kind of place this is. We appear to be standing on a stage, a fairly gaudily decorated one, like for a concert. The stage itself isn't lit, but it's overly decorated and exaggerated in every way possible. Simply put, it's designed screens Rise back in showbiz. What in the world is this? Just who the heck are you? Not who the heck are you? You put this thing together. You what built are you it. Trying to accomplish. Kuse, Kuj, I just want to connect with all of you. Who are you? Look, see how many have been waiting for your comeback. Is this the shadow world? Where's Teddy? Oh, sh it's shadows. Tied up by are these shadows. They have to be. Now, aren't you seeing? Dance for them. It'll make everyone happy. Shut up. Uh oh. Okay, I'll dance. The shadows that fill the seats give an eerie cheer. They sway their bodies as if committed to us. Or commend to us. What are these shadows? No, they've been waiting for our... No, for Rise's performance? On closer inspection, the shadows' bodies are all connected from their necks and hands. Necks hands and legs with strange ribbons writhing as if something as if alive themselves. This isn't good. If a battle breaks out, it won't be easy breaking through their numbers. Just the three of us. I've had enough of this! I wanna go home. You kidnap us to who knows where, and now you want us to dance with these shadows? To hell with that! Send us back home! Now! Are we going home? The shadows. What's going on? All of a sudden, the shadows start moving, and the uh, silent stillness falls upon the area. At the same time, the music, no, more like an eerie song I'd been hearing ever since entering the world, begins increasing in volume as if encroaching from far beyond. Send you back. Now, you're all going to dance. What about my friends? That's what everyone's here for, after all. What about Kanji? That's an mysterious voice, a loud reply. The shadows begin moving their limbs in time to the song as if they're dancing. Suddenly, we're hit with an overwhelming weakness with the fight just to remain standing. What's happening? Uh, 
I don't know what's going on. What is this? I feel weak. Do I need to dance? Don't you feel it? So that song and the shadows dance is what's affecting us. You senpai. Right. I'll dance. I instinctively you would sense Nanto's intent and react at the same time. As if Nanto's quick draw, I called my persona in my heart. I'm completely simultaneous. Persona! Persona! Whoa! Oh, shoot. Izanagi! I don't know your persona's name. What? No. Wait, what happened? Where's our personas? My bullet disappeared. And Senpai's persona, too? <laughs> What's happening? Is this your doing? Do what? I told you now I can't hurt you. Shadows aren't people! Unbelievable! <laughs> like a smoke before they even reach the shadows. Like the mysterious voice said, it isn't getting anything violent at all somehow negated in this world. Uh, what do you want from us? I think it's to dance. <laughs> okay, acceptance. Let's have to dance. I don't wanna. It's alright. Don't be frightened. I am scared. Let's dance together. Won't you join us? Rise Kujikawa. Do I get a bust a schmoove? This is bad. No, I can't. Rise san the phone. Yo, what kind of funky tunes you got on that thing? I can't lose. So what a bit. What the I can move again? But how? Her phone. But the, the funky tunes. We need to move. The shadows are being affected by our music and movement. It's just as I thought. That eerie song we're hearing is forcing the shadows to dance. If we can interrupt that song and the shadows dance, we might get through this. But how? I don't know. We gotta bust the schmoove. Comes to mind. If we can force them into a different song and dance like before, then maybe. Wait. How do you how do you have the song? Wait. No. Nato. Wait. You're connected with us. Now you can become who everyone wants you to be. What the hell? What actually what's happening? We just have to get those shadows moving to our music, right? Risa? Senpai, if that stuff Nato kun was saying is true, then there is something we can do to Is she dead? Right now. Huh? I'll try and use my persona. Maybe I can deliver our music to those shadows at full blast. The way they reacted to my music earlier. This angle's a little off. I might be able to affect but... them a little bit. Can we, can we move on? But... I really want to just skip it, but I gotta I watch it for the enough. lore. That's why I need your help too, Senpai. I'm here to assess. I get to play the game! It's been like literally an hour! I've been streaming for an hour if you combine the time. I've almost been streaming for an hour on this stream alone! Let me play the game! Let me dance! It's gamer time. Alright. Song number one, maybe? Let's go get it. Midnight stage. Time to make history. I can do this. All right, here we go. Smooth time. Bang. Bang. Is the, is the sun easy mode? Oh, the background's way different. Oh my god, it changes. All right. Brown. I'm missing notes as shit. If I 
can just keep this up. You're doing great. I can feel what's in your heart. Yeah, I'm. This is a terrible open. I so I mean, yeah. I full comboed a, a a super hard one on three. I you shouldn't be too bad. How's that? All right. Whoa, the background's totally right. freaking out behind me. This is kind of a bop. I meant darn. I'm getting creep. Ah, oh my god. I'm terrible at this. This is the first game. It's because it, I'm used to that moving fast. That might be my issue. That or I just suck. You're doing great. It's working. The shadows are going for it. I've only heard bits and pieces of this in uh, Blaze yeah. Blue, because I'm pretty sure when you do like Astral finishes with the Persona 4 characters, Persona this is, is what plays. I think the same goes for um, uh, Persona 4 Arena too. Not just for hurting, and not just for fighting. All right. Right now, I know I can show you how I really feel. How's that? We will never stop changing. Answer my call. He's a Nagi. Alright, I called it. He's the Nagi. He actually shows up here. <gasps> he gets a guitar. Oh my god. Whoa! Wow! That's awesome! That went exactly the way I pitched it. Wait, money? What do I do with money? Okay. What do I do with the money? There's a current there's the in-game things I can buy? Do I buy costumes? What the hell? This game's already confusing me. I steady my ragged breath and stand locked in place as the adrenaline dies down. I see, I only realize after dancing, but in front of the audience for the first time, but dancing really is an expression. It seems like they're conveying whatever your heart is easier in this world compared to ours. At first the shadow was just pushing the eerie song at me, but then I can feel the hearts being drawn to it while music and dancing. The eerie voice in the shadows must have been using that system to control to, to, to try to control us. Instead we used it against them. In other words, we won them over. Still. Actually, what was that persona just now? There was something different about it. It was Izanagi. I'm not sure. But when I thought I wanted to convey my feelings to those shadows, my persona responded from within me. <sighs> Way to go, senpai! I hope all the levels are like that. That's really cool. Leader. Only you can pull off something that amazing. Never mind, I guess it's only going to be in used uh, levels. <laughs> Come on. I assume there are multiple characters to play as in the story mode. It's true, ever since I felt like self conveying my heart to the shadows, I had kind of a newfound determination. Undertale, I had nothing concrete backing it up, but I felt it clearly in truth my persona was responding to my desire to express my feelings. It took a new form, we still continued to change. Ever since the case is in and we got back on a normal day to day, I felt almost uncertain, wondering how I could move forward, but then, just then, my persona erased any doubts I had. Uh, I... Hi, Nato! Nato-kun, we did it! Senpai gave him a super sweet show! Yeah! I sensed it as well. That's what allowed me to return to my right mind. Swag! You sensed it? But you got caught by that ribbony thing and... Yes. Because of that, I learned something about those shadows. Really? What did you find out? When caught in that ribbon, it's as if you're forced to be the you that others desire, rather than how you perceive yourself. You're made to believe you want to be tied to the other shadows with that most dreadful thing is that I myself felt sure that it was what I needed to do. Damn. Just as I thought Naso's theory and my int intuition, it seems clear that the song and the shadows dancing meant to bind us to their will. As I speculate, Rise will somehow be unhappy with Naso's words, she pouts indignant. 
That's crazy. You're no one else but you now to accrue. I'm gonna skip over this because this is just. Oh my gosh, you're you. Oh wait, never mind. I mean, I've met. Wait, oh shadows. Okay. What's going on? Are they going away? Suddenly, the cheering shadows of in the glow shine even brighter and begin dissolving as if melting into light. It's a beautiful sight, despite the situation we're in, but I can't help but the marvel. Wow. But the marvel at the marvel. It's beautiful. Then we skip some more. All the shadows are gone, so I assume we're going to get out of here, right? You don't like this state. No, I don't. You Members them? of Kanamine Kitchen. Did you kidnap them? <laughs> I care. Persona. P Persona. There are some places where shadows are bunched up. <gasps> I found someone. No. Ah! no. Uh oh. What's happening? Was I? Have I been shadowed? <laughs> Are we dead? Is this the end of the Persona 4 spin-offs? Is this why Atlas won't make a new Persona game? <laughs> oh, the fuck? I don't know. Where are we? Are we back in the studio? We are! Okay, I... I uh, Takura Productions. I really just want to skip over this. Just tomorrow? Did you just sense to Given what we heard... Then? Please... Oh, of course. Yeah, we're saving him. Obviously. So I'm skipping over this. I honestly could care less. I, at this point, I get the what we're doing. We basically gotta go save the four members of the Kanamain Kitchen. Uh, it's nothing too serious. I assume this is where the chapter ends as well. Oh, Margaret's... Margaret, maybe? Ba, 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 ba. Hello! Velvet room. <laughs> that is how their festival began. What do you think? Fate is truly full of surprises, no? Indeed. They faced themselves and gained the power to stand up against difficulties. But their next trial was quite different. Rather than a contest of strength, it re yeah. The woman smiles joyously before looking towards you again. However, this did not deter him. And as if in response to that firmness of will, his power changed. <laughs> Fascinating, don't you think? By the yeah. way, have you thought about why you have found yourself here? I don't know. <laughs> don't worry yourself over it. I don't have that answer for you. But who does? I asked only out of my own curiosity. While the woman raises her hand, the same light radiates from its swallowing the surrounding scenery. Here is where scenery. we left off with their festival. Is it going to take me to a chapter screen? Because I really, really... No, we're back here. Okay, whatever. The next day, Risei calls now telling me we might as well just practice until the other others get here. Yo, <gasps> oh, <laughs> I missed it! That makes no sense when you're not in the costume, man. Kanji! Yosuke seems overwhelmed by the unexpected heat wave and takes exaggerated deep breaths. Haha, <laughs> same old Yosuke, even though we must have gotten Risa's message about what happened, none of them seem too fake. That doesn't necessarily mean they're taking the situation lightly, it just means they've already made up their minds on what to do. I'm glad you're all here. Hey, have you met any celebrities yet? Are they cute? Tell me everything! Shut nope. I wonder if I should take back what I said before. Yosuke's not struggling this off, is he? Kanji. <gasps> Kanji or Teddy is one thing, but seeing him like this is making Gloria a little. Uh, there's always someone like him. Come on, Yosuke-senpai, you were just here the other day to film the commercial. Yeah, but I was too nervous then to think about any of that stuff. Yeah, but where's oh, Kanji? Is finally I'm in a big city, and not some dreary country town. And I get to hang out with celebrities. It's like a dream come true. Well, excuse us for- Hi, Chie. You are the best Persona 4 girl. Fight me. Uh... Is that what you think of Inaba, Yosuke-kun? Ahem. <laughs> Did you forget that I'm gonna think about it. I'm gonna think about Kaji. Get him on screen. Like Yo! 
Kanji! It's him, Kanji. Memorized every damn thing about that Kanamine chicken or whatever. Kanamine chicken. Kept blabbering on and on about the girls nonstop. Even knows their full names. That's a bit rough, Yosuke. Dude, what? You're bringing that up now? Now is a better time than ever. Looks like the whole world's against him. I don't have any way, any way to back him up either. All I can do is keep quiet while making a mental apology to Yosuke. A volley of cold stares and frigid words enough to blast away the sudden heat wave I launched at my partner. You're the worst. Damn. Seriously, the worst. Bruh. Just completely terrible. Oh my god. Yosuke, you're awful. <laughs> Teddy, I, I hate to bring this up, but wasn't your main reason behind turning into human so you could quote unquote score with Chie and Yukika? Uh, I I don't really hate to hate to be a bother, but isn't that like the main reason you're standing instead of being in your dumb bear costume right now? I just got here and I'm already catching hell. And Teddy. What are you taking their side for? Exactly. Looks like the dream is dead. Damn. Mostly thanks to you. Your kanji just pointed out the facts, Yosuke. Uh, anyway. You're just mad that the truth is coming out. That aside, I had a message for you. Dojima-san and Nanako-chan are gonna be running a little late. Why? It sounded like he's been busy with work. Of course he is. <sighs> Wait, is that what you said? Oh, okay. But then again. Maybe it was actually like a blessing in disguise since Ojima and Sana and Nanako are arriving later. Since we know that the strange things are going to be happening, I can share what I found without pointing any directions from Ojima san The only time part of it pretty grim since Yosuke pats me on the shoulder and flashes me an encouraging smile. Come on, cheer up, partner. Just have a little patience, and Nanako chan will be here in no time. Yeah, that's not what we're really worried about. Man, that was one hell of a long trip. I've been sitting down so long, my butt's sore. It's like ass, we Kanji. We really should have taken the express train. But Yosuke had to insist we ride a bus instead. Why? Dude, you guys are the ones who said you were low on cash. There's no way I could have paid for all your tickets. I have to say, you three aren't looking very well. Are you okay? Did you sleep badly? Uh, that's one way to describe it. The three of us can't help but exchange plans as it goes expression. I was planning on getting a good night's rest, but then I kept thinking about the case and ended up almost getting no sleep. Seeing the way Naoto and Risei react. It must have been the same way for them. A lot happened last night, after all. You mean that midnight stage stuff? Though it was so out of nowhere? I read it too. Those girls are being held captive. Oh, they already know? I'm well, sorry. then I guess that means I can skip through the whole thing. I'm sorry, Kaji. I'm really sorry. But I want to play the game. This is just meeting up with Mr. Professor Man. That's not Professor, but still. Just get me to a chapter screen. Beginning tutorial, no. Oh, it just it skips over the tutorial. Okay. Wait. Oh, I can pause the game. Uh, chapter select. Oh! It doesn't tell me when... Oh! Okay. Well... I guess that calls it for the stream. Actually, it looks like I want to see Hello, what this everyone. is. everyone. Welcome to the home shopping show, Tanaka's Amazing Commodities. I'm your host, Tanaka, with a live presentation of my amazing commodities. We'll show you great items at unbeatable um, prices. What does this oh, stuff do? Won't be able to oh, it's just dial. items. Let's well, bring I guess out I our special that. of the day. You, Naruto. Is everyone watching closely? Order now, and this item will be delivered straight to your doorstep. Oh, uh, I probably have to do a, a lot of this. Is probably unlocked through uh, oh, this is story stuff. Uh, whatever. I actually want to see what the menu for free dance looks like before I end up the stream. Do I just have in free dance? You can enjoy the rhythm gameplay with the difficulty and track of your choice. As you play, you will gain new tracks and money for shopping. It is recommended that first time players play the tutorial. I already did. No. Okay. We got cool. This is okay. I actually really like this song. Uh, and then there's this guy. Okay. Uh, so that's the stream. I actually was pretty excited to play this, and I came out of the game uh, excited too. I'm pretty hyped to see where the story goes moving forward. We are still currently on chapter one, technically, uh, so game's moving a little slow. I think they're divided into chapters for characters, 
Uh, so, assuming that the Yunaru coming on the bottom means what I think it means, and his character icon being here and not in the opening. So, assuming that that's the case, uh, we will be going through, I believe, we got you, Yosuke, Kanji, Teddy, Chi, 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 Chie, Yukiko, Naoto, Rise. Uh, yeah, so that leaves eight stories to go through, so... This will be fun. I'm excited to see if this goes moving forward, and I can't wait to play this next stream. I'm going to try and make the next stream not super far off like last time. So, yeah. Uh, if you're catching the highlights, then uh, if you want to see more of these, then you can uh, check out the Twitch uh, streams. Um, I stream Twitch, and I'm not super funny live, but it's alive, so you're there. So, yeah. Uh, thank you all so much for watching, uh, and I will catch you all next time. See you then.